Okay, so my day went to being a really, okay, we're gonna take it easy type of day to get a letter from the city that my Jeep was junk and it had to be moved. So now I'm trying to get the darn thing started. And of course the starter's acting up, so. <sighs> it ain't one thing, it's another. I don't feel like jacking it up. Plus, that ain't gonna make this hole any any easier to get into. Is that a fifteen? Um, that's a fifteen. Yes, it is. Okay, let me see if what's the deal here. Well, that fits. The trouble is, is that ratchet won't fit up in there. Well, let's see if we can get this one up in here. You got that thing in my face. <laughs> Anything you can see is your hand. Ugh. My hand. See my hand. Oh, I know it's gonna slip and kill me. <clears throat> oh God. It would help if I could get under here to get some leverage. <laughs> Nothing I can get through right there. Arr, arr. <laughs> oh! And here we go again. So that's why I wish I could get that one in there. But I can't. can't get in a position to push. You have to turn that off and come over here and get on my feet again. Yeah. Of course this ain't gonna fit. Now I need the, <laughs> uh, I need the other ratchet. Hold on a second, I'll be right back. <laughs> oh my Jesus God. You know, sometimes it's nice knowing how to do stuff, but when you get in a situation like this, it's not so nice anymore. Well, let's see if I can use this as a pry. You ready? We're thinking outside the box. Oh, God, yes, it broke. Oh. Oh, just a little wrench, or a big wrench, to put on the end of my ratchet. Gave me enough what I needed, because I couldn't get a big ratchet up in there, which would give me better leverage. I could only get this one up in there. And of course, no, it just fell off. Here we go again. Oh, God. Oh, God. some sort of little mini power tool to go up in this hole and work. My hands weren't so slick, I could probably do this a lot easier. Okay, it's starting to come out. Thank goodness gracious. Well, I gotta drop this starter and then we gotta test it. How do we test it? Um, you'll see. Whew. I 
there's the little bolt that goes on this side. And there's the starter. And now we gotta get all this stuff. Let that thing hang down there, oh God. It feels pretty sticky like that even. Okay, cut her off. I gotta go wash my hair. Don't get all this geek in there. Oh. That's a good breeze. Oh, we got my face towels. How it's hot. Ow. You can pull it off? No, I can at least touch that now. That's bearable. Oh, pretty hands I got. Oh, give me a little bit more. I'm in this area. Okay. My little white Jeep has been sitting here and the city just sent me a letter that we're not supposed to have junk in our yard. It did have a flat tire and it was dirty granite, but it's not junk. It just needs worked on so we can get it going again. I mean, it's, it's far from junk. I gave it a good bath and aired the tire up and oh, whatever. So I guess I'm gonna have to have it hauled down to my other property and work on it down there, which is gonna make things really inconvenient since all of my tools are here at the house. Yep. That's my piece of huh. Got a little bit of body work. I gotta add a little bit, uh, get a piece of some panel and add down there so I can get a sticker. But, you know, whatever. <laughs> oh well, anyway. Good day, y'all. I'm gonna take a break and go smoke me a cigarette and get me some coffee and then we're gonna test that starter and see if there's something going on with that or where we're at. So, here is the code violation that I am being required to correct. Ugh. I wish I still lived out in the country. <laughs> oh well. That's how the cookie crumbles. <laughs>